I thought the 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 first three sessions were fantastic, and that those were intentional with having uh, speakers come from abroad uh, uh, to speak to us locally from perspective from their own markets. Uh, uh, we had almost 16 speakers in, and uh, and the ones which uh, made the most impact, I thought, were those who were uh, uh, clients of uh, of of, the, of of us uh, marine surveyors, the underwriters. Uh, ship owners were speaking to us. Uh, uh, we had uh, we had uh, a club, PNI club out there. So I personally feel uh, the brokers, uh, all these are influencers or actually people who, who give us business uh, as surveyors. And uh, uh, and there's not one surveyor speaking uh, up there back to us as surveyors. There was one loss adjuster uh, 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 and a very senior one to that. But none of uh, us surveyors were speaking to us surveyors. So in my view. Uh, all those who came and traveled down to speak to us uh, as a fraternity uh, uh, were all equally good and I really want to thank them for the, the contributions they've made. Although the slots were purposefully kept for 20 minutes so that the presentations were to the point and tight, I think the, the, the feedback that I received was uh, tremendously uh, optimistic if, and encouraging for our next conference that we're going to have in two years from now. Well, the advice I would like to uh, give to future members is that uh, it is your loss that you have not been in this uh, fraternity this far. But uh, the message is uh, with uh, with open arms. Uh, we as uh, we as uh, a branch and uh, myself as a as uh, uh, the president of the institute uh, would like to see uh, all those who are serious about this profession and are practicing surveying uh, in our folds. Uh, there's an absolute open door. Uh, we are all collectively here to gain uh, from being um, uh, a fraternity, a bunch which our clients and our employers, uh, those who give us business, refer us or influence business, understand that we are serious about our training, our professionalism. We do get information and benchmarking from around the world and how this industry is uh, being, uh, being conducted uh, by those who are uh, on foreign shores. Most of our clients actually are from foreign shores. Uh, may it be underwriters, charters or, or uh, yacht owners or uh, brokers uh, who, who actually play a big role in influencing business towards uh, us to be uh, substantially uh, gaining reputation from. So uh, please come along, join the institute. Uh, we have open doors, open arms uh, and I would like to uh, have each and every one of those non-members uh, amongst our fold in whatever uh, uh, membership category that they, they, they fit into. Uh, start with uh, my most appreciation goes to the, my, my, uh, my, my mentors who, who have uh, put the right sense into uh, my head, our, our mentors, those who are committee members who have uh, signed up for this cause, giving away their time for free. Uh, those are the guys who actually are walking the talk of uh, harmony, of, of synergy, of professionalism. I want the world to understand that uh, these are the people who are serious about professionalism upgrading and are holding hands and walking together uh, uh, in, uh, in, in, in surveying fraternity, in independent surveying fraternity, wanting to enhance the, the, uh, the profession. Uh, those sponsors uh, I would like to thank second uh, and those sponsors are uh, the ones who have put their money where the mouth is. I know how difficult these times are and how difficult it is to put budget aside. Uh, we've seen the difference between how money was flowing into these conferences in the first, second and third conference and how difficult it's been for the other th last three conferences. Uh, in spite of these economic times, they've, they've stood by us, supported us, backed us and have uh, actually given us uh, whatever little they could. Uh, as a result, we had the privilege of having this conference free of charge for all members and non-members. Uh, in the hall today, the 81 of them uh, having um, uh, a fantastic day, uh, all 14 speakers. Uh, so there was enough, uh, enough uh, uh, financial power and goodwill thrown into this conference today, which uh, collectively made this uh, a success. Hello, I'm speaking to you at the uh, end of a fantastic day. Uh, I'm here aboard the QE2 in Dubai. We've been here for the sixth biennial IRMS UAE branch conference. 
and uh, it celebrates the 10th anniversary of the branch. It's been an absolute pleasure and an honour to have hosted the conference today. I'd like to say personal thanks to Captain Zaria Rani, uh, the President of IMS, his colleagues, all the other people who've given selflessly of their time to make the event uh, such a great success. I think in particular I would like to thank the speakers. We've covered a huge range of very topical, on-trend um, subjects today. Mr. Cled Cargos was the one that uh, I think perhaps really caught my imagination and the fact that there are people uh, who are going to see and dying because of Mr. Clare's cargoes, I think is something that the industry needs to be uh, very, very serious about solving. It would be wrong to highlight any particular presenter. I think all presenters have presented uh, at a very, very high level. I'm grateful to them. And uh, the final message I have is um, we thank all IMS members, not just in the Middle East and the UAE branch, but around the world. Thank you very much.